Hey, what's up guys? This is DTJ. Don't forget to join my channel. There's a link at the bottom of this video. Lots of good stuff for members. And we are at the largest mall in Japan today, actually. This is called Aeon Lake Town. It's out in Saitama Ken. I don't want anyone to fool you. It's not in Tokyo, like at all, but it is highly accessible. There's a train that will drop you off at the mall at the Kaze, or Wind Building. Which, by the way, is just one of the buildings that make up this massive mall. The other buildings are the Mori Building and the Outlet Mall. What can I say about this mall? Only good things. Ample parking if you were driving here. We came here on a weekend and didn't have to grab a chushiken or a parking card or even ask for the parking to be validated. So basically, parking was free. Big plus for me. Secondly, it seems that this mall was designed with convenience in mind. I say that because, well, there are restrooms on every floor. Not like some malls in Japan where you got restrooms on one floor and like you got to go three more floors to hit another restroom. Nah, that don't go here. There are even kid restrooms where everything is scaled down significantly for children. Big deal for parents actually with toddlers, trust me. And there are bridges that connect the buildings so you can be in the outlet mall then walk into the Kaze building which is where we started from, so you can easily get to your car. Don't get me started on the food options. Lots of food, I mean, a lot. If I had to put a number on it, I'd say there were easily 20 restaurants in just one food court. And there are two food courts in the Mori building alone. That's just food courts, not to mention the actual restaurants and other buildings. And they are damn good too.
let's check out this Victoria shop. So, back in Kanagawa Ken where I live, Zebio Sports is the big brand for sporting equipments and such. And we only have a Victoria Golf, so I didn't really think it was a big deal. I was surprised to see that this place was so nice. Lots of good deals going on, great gear in here, I love it. I do have one complaint though, because I gotta have something to complain about. And it's not really their fault, it's just Japan in general. They never seem to have my shoe size, and my foot isn't even big by American standards. Anyway, I'm a size 10, which is a size 28 in Japan. They never have my shoe size and I wanted these LeBron James 19 tropical edition sneakers but I kind of have my hopes up a little bit but that's something you should know. Be ready to shop elsewhere for sneakers if you are a size 10 and up because Japan rarely has them in stock. If you're lucky they will special order them for you. That's not something they regularly do. Thank you. 
There's the Mori over there. The Mori side. So we are now going into the Mori building. Honestly, to show you everything, I'd have to make the video two hours because this place is massive. Take it from me though, it is good shopping and fun for the family. So some must go to stores for the guys, I'm going to say Victoria Sports and the Hobby Zone. For the kids, I'm going to recommend the Lego store, the Namco store, and the Disney store. For the ladies, well, <laughs> the world is your oyster because there are just so many shops with women here. But that's Japan in general, right? So Aeon Lake Town, located in Saitama Ken. Catch the train here if you can't drive. If you are driving, you don't have to worry about parking. The roof alone on the Kaze building must have had about 300 spots on it easily. Must check it out. Bring your debit card. I'm DTJ. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. DT out.